Hello, my dear students. I am Raj Kaliya, working with the Vrindavan Group of Institutions as a Mathematics Professor. In the free time, I am working for you people by uploading the videos. So please go through the videos and uh, get math easy. I am trying my best to keep it in the simplest possible way. So please go through and see. Today I am going to teach you multiple and some multiple angles. Multiples and uh, some multiple angles. Angles like 2A, 3A. Angles like 2A, 3A, 4A, etc. are known as multiple angles because they are the multiples of A, multiples of A, multiples of A, 2, 3, 4, etc. Some multiple means it is with the fraction. Angles like A by 2, A by 3, A by 4 are known as a some multiple angles. How to find the values? We have done the identities already. Sin A plus B equals sin A cos B plus cos A sin B. Cos A plus B equals cos A cos B minus sin A sin B. Tan A plus B is 2 tan A over 1 minus tan square A. Now come to the first one. Sin A. Sin A plus B equals sin A. cos b plus cos a sin b put b equals a so replace b by a sin a plus a sin a cos a replace b by a cos a sin replace b by a sin 2a equals sin a cos a sin a cos a that is 2 sin a cos So thus we have got identity for sin 2a which is 2 sin a cos a. Come to the second identity. We know cos a plus b. equals cos a cos b cos a cos b minus sin a sin so replace b by a we will get cos a plus a cos a cos a sin a replace b by a so cos 2a equals cos square a minus sin square a So, identity of cos 2a is cos square a minus sin square a. Here we can put the value of cos square and sin square also. That is cos 2a. Cos square a is 1 minus sin square a. For cos square a, put 1 minus sin square a. Because we know the identity sin square a plus, co plus cos square a is 
इज वन साइन स्क्वे रे प्लस कॉस के रे इज वन सो फ्रॉम देयर वी कैन फाइंड कॉस के रे इक्वल वन माइनस साइन स्क्वे रे कॉस टू ए इक्वल्स वन माइनस साइन स्क्वे रे एंड माइनस साइन स्क्वे रे वन माइनस टू साइन स्क्वे रे सेकेंड एडेंटी फॉर कॉस टू ए Now here, for the value of sine, so that is cos two a can be written as cos square a minus for sine square one minus cos square. It is from the identity that sine square a. Plus cos square a equals one. So it will come out to be cos square a minus one plus cos square. Thus cos square a plus cos square a two cos square a minus. So it's a third entity for cos two a. Cos two a is cos square a minus sine square a. Cos two a is one minus two sine square a. Cos two a is two cos square a minus one. Then next come to the ten. Now for ten, we know. Tan a plus b equals tan a plus tan b over one minus tan a tan b. Tan a plus tan b <coughs> over one minus tan a. B equals a. So we'll get ten a plus a ten a plus ten a replace b by a one minus ten a replace b by a. Tan two a equals two tan a one minus tan square. So this is the identity for tan two a. Then comes two a. Sine two a cos term two a in terms of ten. Sine two a cos two a in terms of ten <coughs> means these identities in terms of ten. We know. We have done now only sine two a equals two sine a cos a. It can be written as two sine a cos a divided by one. <coughs> can be written as two sine a 
cos a over sin square a plus cos square a. Replace this one from the first identity. Dividing both sides. 2 sin a cos a. Dividing numerator and denominator by cos square. Dividing numerator and denominator by sin square a cos square a. Dividing numerator and denominator by sin square and cos square. So thus we will get sin 2a Thus we will get sin 2a equals to sin a cos a divided by cos square a sin square a plus cos square a divided by cos square a divided numerator and denominator by cos square a equals cos cos 1 power we can cancel 2 sin a by cos a here cos square put it in the denominator of both sin square a by cos square a plus cos square a by cos square a. Thus it equals 2 tan a over tan square a plus 1. Thus this identity is sin 2a sin 2a equals 2 tan a over 1 plus tan square which is the identity of sin 2a in terms of tan sin 2a in terms of a tan so then we will do cos 2a in terms of tan cos 2a equals cos square a minus sin square a then cos 2a can be written as cos square a minus sin square a divided by 1 cos 2a cos square minus sin square a is the identity for 1 put cos square a plus sin square a Dividing numerator and denominator by cos square a, we will get cos 2a equals cos square a by cos square a minus sin square a by cos square a. In the denominator, we will get cos square a by cos square a plus sin square a by cos square a. Cos square a, cos square a, we can cancel. We will get 1 minus sin square a by cos square a is 10 square a. Here we can cancel, we will get 1 plus sin square a by cos square is 10 square a. Thus cos 2a will come out to be 1 minus 10 square a over 1 plus 10 square a. Now come to sin 3a. We want to sin 3a, 
we know that we can write that sin 3a instead of writing we know that we can write sin 3a as we can write now identity for sin 3a we can write sin 3a as sin 2a plus a so take 2a as b and a, uh, 2a as a and a as b so it will be like sin a plus b sin a cos b plus cos a sin b so here we can we will get sin 3a equals to for sin t 2a put the value that is 2 sin a cos a then cos a plus cos 2a put the value in terms of sin because we are doing it the sign 1 minus 2 sin squared a into sin a thus sin 3a equals 2 sin a cos into a cos square a plus multiply it we will get sin a minus 2 sin cube a sin 3a equals 2 sin a change this cos 2 again in sin 1 minus sin square a plus sin a minus 3 sin cube a sin 3a equals now multiply 2 sin a minus 2 sin cube a plus sin a minus 2 sin cube a thus sin 3a equals 2 sin a and sin a 3 sin a minus 2 minus 2 that is minus 4 sin cube a so like that we will get sin 3a is 3 sin a minus 4 sin cube a. Now come to cos 3a. Now identity for cos 3a. Cos 3a. Put it as cos 2a plus a use the identity of cos a plus b cos a cos b minus sin a sin b equals cos 2a we want now in terms of cos 2 cos square a minus 1. In sin 3a, we have changed everything is in sin. For cos 3a, we will change it into cos only. We will use the identity of cos 2a in terms of cos. Cos a minus. Sin 2a can be written as 2 sin a cos a into sin a equals 2 cos square and cos cos cube a minus cos a minus 2 sin a and sin a sin square a into cos a equals 2 cos cube a minus cos a 2 to sin square a put it as 1 minus cos square a into cos a equals here we are getting cos 3a cos 
ऑस्ट्रिये 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 टू कॉस क्यू बी माइनस कॉस ए एक बाई मल्टीप्लाइंग विल गेट माइनस टू कॉस ए एंड माइनस माइनस प्लस टू कॉस के लिए एंड कॉस ए कॉस क्यू बी कॉस थ्री कॉस क्यू बी एंड कॉस क्यू बी फोर कॉस क्यू बी एंड कॉस ए एंड कॉस ए माइनस थ्री कॉस सो दस इट इज फोर कॉस क्यू बी माइनस थ्री कॉस दैट इज दर कॉस थ्री now come to the identity for sin uh, tan 3 tan 3 put it as tan 2a plus a So use the identity of tan a plus tan b, tan a plus tan b over one minus tan a tan b. After that, put the value of tan two a. tan 2a is 2 tan a 1 minus tan square because we want answer in terms of a only that is why put the value of tan 2 plus tan a One minus tan two a two tan a one minus tan square a plus tan a. So put the value of a tan two a. After putting the value of tan two a. Take LCM. LCM in numerator will be one minus ten square. We will get two ten a by taking LCM. We will get two ten a plus ten a multiplied by this ten a. Then see here carefully. Ten a minus ten q b. Here we have taken the same as one plus ten squared a, so which we can cancel. By cancelling, we have to multiply them. See here. So we have to multiply. That is two ten a plus one minus ten square a into ten a. Ten a into one will be ten a minus ten square into ten will be ten q. Similarly, in the denominator, LCM will come out to be one minus ten square a. So multiply it by One here it's not a positive sign. It's a tan a two tan two tan a plus tan a sorry 
plus 10 a. Now take LCM. When will we take LCM? We will get it as On the denominator, we will get LCM as 1 minus 10 square. So multiply by 1. 1 minus 10 square A minus 2 10 into 10, that is 2 10 square A. This is what we will get. Does it equal? In the denominator 1 minus 10 square, 1 minus 10 square LCM we can cut. And here we will get 2 10 A plus 10 A. That is 3 10 A minus 10 Q. In the denominator we will get 1 minus 10 square A minus 2 10 square A. That is 3 10 square Thus we will get 10 3a equals 3 10 a minus 10 cube a 1 minus 3 10 square a. That is the identity for 10 3. So like that, we can go for sin 3a, cos 3a and tan 3a. So at last again the same request. If you are thinking I am working for you people. So kindly subscribe and put icon bell. Like it also. And in case of any doubt, you can use my WhatsApp number. 9886492317. If any doubt is there, so send me your doubt and, and I will solve and send you back. That's it today. Bye. Good night.